I'm a linguist support uh, NCO. So we basically talk to those uh, guests. We ask them questions, uh, any issues while they're living over here, anything they need, any type of uh, problem they're facing here, like a living condition, any type of health issues, the personal hygiene issues. We're trying to solve this. Uh, obviously, helping those people, it is a big opportunity for me uh, because uh, the, if I look at the, uh, the history or the, what happened in the last 20 years, the, the people over here, those are our allies and they are actually helping us during this uh, mission in Afghanistan and now it's our turn to help them out. So it is a big opportunity to know their language, talk to them and make, give them a very comfort zone. I'm from Afghanistan and I put myself in these people's positions. The acid in the language that I have is that could be um, big use to the units. Being in uniform, welcoming people is a big deal for me and big thing in making sure that people feel comfortable when we speak to them in their dialogue and their language. And this was very important to me to be in here, welcoming them and making them feel comfortable. I'm a linguist, translator, interpreter, cultural advisor. I support the task force and anywhere, everywhere they need my language skill. I volunteer for this project. I'm a fluent 100% in all dialogue, all language of Afghanistan. In uh, every corner of Afghanistan, they speak the dialogue. I'm 100% writing, reading, listening. So I speak uh, multiple languages such as Bengali, Hindi, Urdu, and I, I'm a foreign citizen, foreign American citizen. So uh, I try to give army uh, my skill of language. I was always uh, thinking about to use my language beside my actual MOS. So I, when I get this opportunity, I was really happy and I was really motivated to uh, give my skill to Army. So Army can utilize me for other additional duties that I'm doing right now. In Afghanistan, I was working like most of these linguist, the cultural advisor that they were working, I was local. I know when you get to the country, you want to see someone that who is speaking your native language, who's speaking your own accent. They feel comfortable and they see, okay, thank God there is someone to answer our questions in our language. So I say, you know what, it's a big deal. It's bigger than me, bigger than my MOS and job to come and help.